Hello, welcome back. Today I'm going to show you guys how you can download any of the source code that you want from any of the website. Like, uh, there are a lot of people who keep on browsing the website and find, if they find the website really, very interesting, they want to know the source code, like how was the website created? Uh, what are the things that are used to create this beautiful website? So in the case, you can download the source code and you can watch how the website was created. So for that, you first have to download all the source code from the website. So I'll show you guys how you can download any source code from any of the websites that you want. So the first thing you go to Chrome and you have to download and add an extension and the name of that extension is save resources. So this save all resources, you click here and you'll go and land it to a page like this where you will find your add to Chrome. Click on add to Chrome and this will take some time and here you can click on add extension. This will take some time to add the extension. Okay, now you can see it's written save all resources has been added to Chrome. Okay, now that's done. Next thing you have to do is to go to any of the website that you want, any of the website that you want to download the source code from. Say for example, I want to download the source code of NTA. So I'll first go to your website. Then here, I'll go to inspect. And on inspect, after clicking on inspect, you will find something like this. Here we'll find these tabs, elements, console, sources, network, and this key. So you click here and you can at last, in the one, two, three, four, five, sixth position, you can see this resource server. So in the resource server, the thing you have to click on is you here, beautify, JS, JavaScript, HTML, CSS code before download, and include all assets by access your request. You have to click on here and you can see these resources and the requests are loaded. And you can see here, waiting for reload. Okay, now all the resources are loaded here and I can click on save all resources and download all the resources that are used to create this website. So let me save all resources first. Okay, the resources are getting compressed first. Okay, all my files are downloaded now. You can see here it's mtaaca.zip. So I have to extract it as it's in the zip folder. I'll extract it here in the desktop. Extraction completed successfully. Now, let me go to my desktop and here you can see all the files that I have extracted right now. So now you can see these are the six files that are the source code of that NTA website. To check the index.html or the HTML page, which is the gateway of any website, you have to go to this nta.ac.in. And here you can see this home.html, which is actually the gateway to any website. So open with any application you want to say, I'm opening this with Visual Studio Code, like open with any text editor that you want. So after opening this with Visual Studio Code, you can see all the codes here that are used to, all the HTML code that are used to create this website. And you can do any of the things that you want to you can change anything you want so this is how you download the source code of any of the website that you have uh, that you have gone through or any of the website that you have liked but one thing downloading the source code of any of the website and using it for some kind of things is really illegal like there is a thing called copyright claim and once you get that copyright claim everything is destroyed so remember don't use it in any illegal way the only thing you can do is to I'll learn something, learn how they created the website, how they created the different things if you only find the website interesting. So that's how all it's done. I hope you guys liked the video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and I'll see you again.